Okay, Noemi, let's talk about um, mi, mi objetivo es hacer el examen el próximo junio. My goal is to do the exam next June. My goal is to do the exam next June. Okay, el autobús. Let's see. Ayer hubo algunos, algunas personas que no tenían asiento en el autobús. Yesterday, there were some people who didn't have a seat on the bus. Yesterday, there were some people who didn't have a seat on the bus. Sometimes we say space. They didn't have a space or a seat on the bus. All right, and then we looked at different pictures. Uh, let's see, llamativo. So, su vestido es llamativo. Her dress is eye-catching. Her dress is eye-catching. We can also say striking, striking. All right. Mm, as asqueroso, gross, disgusting. Or something that mi mixes asqueroso y aterrado. No, uh, yeah, aterrado. Uh, scary and gross is creepy. Sorry, I forgot entirely what I was saying. Creepy. Okay, let's see. Uh, okay, lino. El lino es ligera y fluida. Ligero y fluido, perdón. Linen is light and flowy. Linen is light and flowy. When we're describing material and clothing. Okay, uh, ella tiene los manos cruzados. She has her hands crossed. She has her hands crossed. You can cross your fingers, your hands, and your arms. Okay, and then just words like productos. Productos de limpieza. Cleaning products. Y equipo deportivo. Sports equipment. So we don't always have to know the name of something. We can just generalize by calling it a product, a cleaning product, a sport equipment, something like that. Very good.